Welcome back. Here at A Current Affair, we love it when we get a win. And tonight we can report some good news for Lee, who got into a car crash and then an ugly standoff with his neighbour, Brooke. She's the mouthy mum that ran into her neighbour Lee's car. But Brooke was doing everything to then avoid running into him. What country is it OK for someone to crash into your car parked outside your house and not have any responsibility? He only lives up the road from you, Brooke. He could be sorted out. He's tried calling you. He's tried knocking on your door. You're avoiding him, Brooke. Brooke was still driving around without a front bumper and number plate from the prang while Lee's car was a write-off. I got her name and, and phone number and she gave me a licence number and I asked if she was insured and she said yes, that she was insured with Suncor. Lee's car was covered under third party with UE. Brooke then refused to confirm her insurance status, which meant Yui couldn't grant him the uninsured third party cover of up to $5,000 if the other driver was at fault. Why don't you just give him the information that he needs? Turns out Brooke wasn't completely insured for the crash. We can now reveal she only has compulsory third party, the bare minimum needed to register your vehicle. Lee doesn't have Are a car. Yui promised us they would try to resolve things and since our story went to air, they've decided to honour Lee's insurance claim. That five grand have meant a lot to us. We need that money to try and uh, get us another car. Well done, Yui. That seems like a fair outcome. And that's our program. I'm Dimity Clancy. From all of the team, thanks for your company. Have a great evening. Good night.